Ooh, what's up guys? It's been a hell of a two day ride here. Let's go. So, uh, today's Saturday, it's like 6.30, I've been in bed all day. I thought I'd feel better, but I'm not. Uh, I'm not saying it's COVID, but I'm definitely gonna get a test. Girlfriend doesn't feel well either. Some of the people we went to Florida with don't feel well. Actually, two of the five. I don't know what's going on. I haven't felt this bad in uh, many, 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 many years. But I wanted to muster the strength to kind of get out of bed for a minute and uh, chat. Because when you're laying in bed, you tend to think. And I need to admit that I was wrong about something in yesterday's video. Let's go. So, 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 so. I got clickbaited. Your driver, Mike, I saw a community post. It was also sent to me by somebody about a 5K bonus. Pedro, have you seen this? I was like, well, this is pretty neat. I had knew they had done things like this before in the past, but never 5,000. Anyways, I didn't do my research. That is complete click clickbait, complete uh, a mock. And he did say that, so this isn't on him. It's on me. I take 100% fault in that. So if you saw that video, don't think that that's coming to your market. Um, I did in the video talk about, you know, the good and bad with it. We, we had a dialogue. It seems to be that that's not going to happen. There's no 5K bonus for 10K deliveries. Um, so I want to come on here and first admit I was wrong. I didn't do my due diligence before making that video. I thought that was a real thing. It looked real. It's not real. So my apologies to everybody that watched. I've been reading some comments saying, you know, different things about it. It's not real. I got baited. Okay, so I was wrong. You might hear some background noise. There's a lot going on here. So independent contractor. I got into a debate. This is the second thing I think I'm wrong about. I want to admit it and get your guys' opinion. I got into a couple heated debates with a few people back in months ago. And I even made a video about it. I was saying we are independent contractors and why. Some people were telling me that they are true independent contractors and why. Um, I've changed my stance. I don't think we're independent contractors. Uh, based on what these gig apps do, what they show us, what they don't. We can't negotiate pay. We don't even see pay results sometimes. I think we're, I, I'm going to say right now, I'm going to jump the fence and we're, we are misclassified. Maybe by the letter of the tax code, we might be, but the day-to-day -day stuff, we definitely are not independent contractors. And I'm, that's what I'm saying. Uh, so I was definitely wrong months ago when I made that particular video. Um, I just don't see how we are true independent contractors. I think we're misclassified. The companies do that so that they can get to tax breaks and don't have to give us benefits and various other things. I'm not mad that we're misclassified, but I definitely think that um, we're misclassified. I don't think we're independent contractors and a lot of content creators push the independent contractor deal. I was one of them and I'm changing my mind and I can do that because I'm a human being. And uh, what do y'all think? You know, those are two things I've been wrong on and I wanted to just, I was wrong. So, you know, I think you gotta, when you, when you do something wrong or, or, you know, you could change your mind on things as you have more information and I was wrong. Now, the hoodie Pedro's out, not only because I don't feel well, but I want to address something and let's go. So if you don't like, just, you might, might you might not want to watch anymore, but well, let's see. So I started this channel with me in a car with a phone doing videos every single day. And I've continued to do that every single day. I think I've missed two days of video. I think I missed this past week. I didn't do a video, but I think I went like on Saturday. We didn't do one. And then I didn't do one months ago because whatever. But I've done a video every day. I do ride alongs. And if there are topics, I talk about topics because that's what I do. And there are a handful of people that, uh, you know, and I support a lot of channels. I think you guys know that. I support channels that are big, channels that are small. I do collaborations. Um, and I've said, you know, and I'll say this, just because you have a small sub count doesn't mean you have a bad channel. Just because you have a big sub count doesn't mean your channel's good, right? I think the sub counts matter because it's people are joining and they're hitting that subscribe button and that's very humbling. But at the end of the day, your sub count doesn't make your content good or bad. I believe that my favorite channel out there right now, Dasher Pass, I think she has 170, 180 subscribers. She's my favorite YouTuber. I've said that. I did a community post about her. 
Um, I just like her sarcasm. I like her sense of humor. I like how different her videos are. So she doesn't have a lot of subs. And then there are some channels that have a lot of subs. And I think their channel is absolute garbage. It's my opinion. Everybody can have and like what they like and subscribe to what they don't like and whatever. I say that because I support a lot of channels and I go in when I see people are live, I go into their lives. And in the last month or so, my name gets popped up and talked about so often and I don't know why. I don't know why. And I'm humbled that people are even saying my name as much as they are. I hopped in a live today. I'm just on my phone I, and there he is again, my name. People talk and it's, it, it, it baffles me that I am, and it's, it's a few people, it's not a lot, but it, I think it's funny. I just want to address it because at the end of the day, I don't hide from nothing. You got questions, I got answers. I'll hop in alive. Somebody's got something to say, I see it. I respond. I give honest and truth answers. I don't hide from nothing, but then they leave the room. It's very childish. Um, I've even reached out to people directly via text or email. They don't say nothing back. So I don't, I purposely don't get in the comment sections and do that kind of stuff. If I got your direct line, I'll reach you directly or I'll email you. And some people got an opinion about me. And you know what? I'm good with that. But I don't understand. I feel like I haven't gotten into somebody's live where there hasn't been my name spoken or indirect comment about 90%, 10%, all this stuff. And I think it's hilarious. Thank you. You're helping me, my channel. But at the end of the day, like... At the end of the day, if you got a pin, if you don't like me that much and you disagree with what I say, why are you watching? All you got to do is hit unsubscribe and then hit that you don't like this channel and you'll stop seeing my videos. But I feel like you're talking about me because I don't know why, but it's fascinating to me. <laughs> and I've been thinking about it. I'm not going to lie. I've been thinking about it today and I laugh. So I don't know. I try to show support to a lot of people and, uh, you know, I have difference of opinions with people. I'll go into there. You know, we, we talk and I think that that's good. But all this stuff going on behind the scenes, like I see it. So keep talking about me. Appreciate it. But if I hit you on a direct line, like. At least respond back, you know, what I'm saying like I, I just don't get it. Everybody just wants to talk about it in the comments and they don't expect me to come in their room because I'm a big channel. I have 15,000 subscribers. In this community, I guess that's large compared to some other people, but I don't feel like I have a big channel. And I've been doing the same thing on this channel every single day. And if you think differently, if you think I've changed, stop watching. And I think some of you guys have, and I'm cool with that, but get my name out your mouth. Get my name out your mouth. Please move on. Do something else with your time. Because it seems like, and this isn't a coincidence, man. Like, it, it's crazy to me. It seems like these people have just got to, they just, <sighs> okay, that's it. I just wanted to get that off my chest. I feel better now. Hopefully we'll go live tomorrow. I do have one more announcement. Okay, so I try not to give my energy to people that don't like me or whatever, don't agree with me, blah, blah, blah. I stand true with everything I say. And if I'm wrong, I'll admit it like I just did on some things. But just one guy, guy. I'm just one dude, okay? I'm just one dude, okay? So... We are going to, uh, I'm going to have a join button. So what that means to some of y'all, I'm going to start it tomorrow probably. Hopefully we go live tomorrow. If I feel well enough, I'll do that. I do have a special guest lined up. I know he's been looking forward to coming on. I've been looking forward to talk to him. So I should be better tomorrow. We'll see. I should. I, if I can do this, I should be able to go live. I'm trying to, you know, get my strength back. So anyways, so you're going to have an option to join. Pedro Dora Santiago's uh, community on a different level. You can become a member. So for, um, I, I don't know what the amount will be that I'll set, but I'm going to do something a little different. So you, you'll see at the videos will be a join button. And you could, like, every month it could be like, you know, $4.99 or $9.99. And you're going to get in, in the lives, like on Sunday, you'll get like special emoji badges and um, special, like special wrenches and kind of stand out. But the main reason I'm doing it is to give back. I don't know how much I'll make from this. I think YouTube takes some. That's not why I'm doing it. I'm doing it because, A, let's be real. People like those little emoji badges and stuff. It's cool. It stands out. And we have a lot of loyal people that come on Sunday. 
It's a lot of the same people. So giving you an option to kind of let the community know that you are uh, a member. But also we're going to give some of that money back to a member every month. So every Sunday, like I did a couple Sundays ago, we're going to give away $100 to a member in live time on a live every the last Sunday of every month. So if you're a member, uh, you'll be entered in to win a hundred bucks. I'll give that money back. If a lot of people join, I'm not sure what to expect. I've never done something like this. I don't know what the analytics are. I'm just trying it out. If, if it's a lot of people are joining and I'm making some money off this, then we'll do 200 bucks a month. I want to give back a good amount of what I earn from the members and give them right back to a, a member every single month. I think that's cool. So we'll wind up giving away at least 1200 bucks this year, maybe 2,400 bucks this year. It just all depends. But either way, even if I get two people that sign up, I'm still giving away 100 bucks every month live on the last Sunday show that we do. So I'm excited about that. Super excited about that. So, and you don't have to, you know, to watch this channel is free. You don't have to ever join. You don't have to ever super chat. I never really ask of that. I never ask that kind of stuff. But I think it's just a way for me to give back and to have fun. It's kind of like a, uh, something to look forward to on the last Sunday. Hey, let's see if I win 100 bucks. The person that we gave it to last time was Blue Eyed One Ten Sixteen. I remember I still have her on my board here, and she was super excited. She even texted me the next day saying, "Thank you so much. That hundred dollars really meant a lot to me." So I want to continue to give back. I don't see anybody else doing that, so I'm gonna do that. Hundred dollars a month to a member. So look out for that join button. Hit it. If you got questions, hit my email about how that works. I can explain them the best that I can. Um, I just wanted to get a couple things off my chest. I'm not feeling great. I didn't work today. I've only worked one day this week. We've made hundred and thirty dollars this week. Um, but at the end of the day, like I talk about, I use the apps as a stepping stone and I have other things going on. So for me to miss basically a week's worth of pay, it doesn't hurt me that bad because I've set myself up. I couldn't always say that, but I can say that now. And I challenge you guys to try to do the same thing. That's all I got. I was wrong about the video I put out yesterday. It's got a lot of views. I actually felt bad about it because I don't want to and I don't make clickbait kind of stuff. And I did not do my due diligence and look into that enough. My apologies. Hopefully I'll see you guys tomorrow on the live. Have a great night. Be safe. See ya.